Steven, I imagine you're headed out here right after the show ends, right? <laughs> Actually, the weather's looking good. It's very tempting with the blue skies and sunshine, warm temperatures for today, and it uh, looks to be very fun down there in Newport. Let's take a look outside in Newport. You can see the harbor not too far away from where Ashley is this morning. Things looking pretty good here, and we have a light breeze out there. But again, overall, no weather concerns expected uh, for this weekend. And one more stop outside in Providence, a little bit further north. You can see again, very similar here, blue sky, sunshine, comfy conditions out here. Current temperatures uh, near 70 in Providence. 69 there, 70 in Newport, 70 over in New Bedford, 76 though up in Smithfield, and a little bit cooler in Westerly at 68, 64 on Block Island. That's where the fog was kind of holding on a little bit longer this morning, so it's taking a little bit longer for those temperatures to warm up. Wind speeds out of the north about five miles per hour or so, otherwise looking at a calm wind for now. It'll shift southeast about five to ten miles per hour for the afternoon, and so that sea breeze uh, kind of kicks up along the shoreline later today. Radar, as has been the case the last several days, staying on the quiet side, not tracking any showers or storms. So threat tracker also remains quiet as well. Low category, not only today and tomorrow, but also into next week as well as that high pressure. Uh, two of them actually in control of our weather. We have one across parts of the Great Lakes and upstate New York, the other one offshore. We're kind of in between the two, so looking at kind of protection on each side of us with those highs, so keeping all the storms away. We are watching one area of interest down here off the Carolina coastline. This actually has the eyes of the National Hurricane Center. They're watching this system for potential development and uh, seeing this if this storm kind of gets itself together and uh, gains some tropical characteristics this would be over the next several days uh, that area offshore of the carolinas off the southeastern coast they're giving about a 50 percent chance of seeing tropical development so what that means is there's a 50 percent chance over the next seven days of it getting to be a tropical depression or even a tropical storm and the uh, next name on the list would be Helene, and that would be again across uh, the southeastern part of the country. Where is the system go from there? Uh, models want to keep it to the south as that high pressure that's been giving us nice weather remains in control. But of course, whenever there's a system off the Carolina coastline, we always just keep an eye on it as it's kind of, you know, a little bit closer to us uh, here at home. So speaking of here at home, bright sky, sunshine for today, temperatures in the 70s across the board, some lower 80s during the afternoon across inland areas. So definitely more summer like and uh, average high temperature at the airport in Warwick, about 75, 76 degrees. So we'll be slightly above that for today. Staying quiet dry uh, this evening into tonight. Some more areas of fog though, late tonight and early tomorrow morning, very similar to this morning and then seeing the sunshine return for your Sunday. Maybe a touch cooler with temperatures back into the 70s, but overall very nice both days. Uh, get outside and enjoy it. Weather's looking good right through Sunday evening and Sunday night. So recapping things this morning, temperatures rising through the 70s again by the middle part of the day, looking at upper 70s and low 80s by this afternoon. Sunshine across the board. Things looking just fine. Nice 0% chance of any rainfall for today. Bay forecast as well. Relatively quiet. Waves about a foot or less. And those winds, like I mentioned, shifting southeast 5 to 10 knots. Next high tide cycle arrives this evening around 5.15. And uh, beach forecast also looking pretty good now that the uh, sun is out. Temperatures middle 70s and a low rip current risk. Seven day forecast for you again. Things looking pretty good through Tuesday. Showers and clouds arrive for Wednesday and through Friday of next week with those cooler temperatures back into the 70s. Full seven day forecast, of course, always on our website at WPRI.com.